Welcome back everyone, we're playing Invasion from the Unknown, this is part 3, and hopefully I won't die as many times as I died the previous time. This is already my second attempt at this part of the scenario, after Malkishar got himself killed, so let's try this again. I'm leading with the spectres here, um, because the spectres are the best at killing demon warriors. Okay, up here we've got a demon too. I'll try and kill it with Ledinor. That's a Shack spell rather than a demon, but you get the idea. Um, Detea, I'm gonna need you. Gonna need you now. Gonna put Alinea down here. So Alinea fights off the demons with Malkashar at her side. Get a healer up behind them. Take this with Erethan. Gallus is gonna come up behind. These folks need to just run. Paranoid about not going over, not going over this starry area with my spectres or, or spirits. They could, but I, they shouldn't. They shouldn't. Uh, okay. Well, I mean, I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing with Igor. Igor is going to be useless against these guys. Um, okay. So. And turn. So that was quite bad. Um, Elinia, who one really needs to for this scenario, it has just been really brutally set upon by Alyssa the Chaos Warlord. And she's going to go around the side. Not that this will save her if Alyssa tries to go for her, but she's going to go and knock out this demon. Meanwhile... Poor old Sathenia. Alright, we've got to slow so we can use the power of the Union. Union does what it's supposed to do, that's good. Last time I was whinging quite a lot about missing with the Union, which given that it's supposed to be this almighty holy attack of, of awesome godlike power, um, it's a little bit frustrating. Okay, a pathetic amount of damage there on this dread bat. Everyone else, I mean you guys, doesn't really matter now who you fight um, because no one's useful against Elinia apart from my heroes. Elissa, not Elinia. Names! Okay, Erethon's dead. Um, unless I send my spectres out over the chasm, which I will now do. Erethon uh, might still be dead. Okay. Um, now you're within range of this guy, which is irritating. Really need to kill this bat. Really need to kill this bat. Alright, bat is dead. You 
come down here, Detea. You come down here, Lidinor. And you stay where you are. And I think that's more or less all I can do now. I'm going to move Galas in to get some more health. Now I think, probably, if I were Alyssa, I would move around and attack Elenia because I could uh, sense weakness. And she won't use slow, and she won't use the Union as a retaliation attack. No, she's running away. Okay. Right, now as I said, I don't actually want that drone to die. Um, this is a somewhat tricky position, because I can't use the Union without... Elissa, I can't. I can't use the union without. I can't get both the slow and the union, unless I use Elinia to slow, and I don't want to do that because Elinia is already very badly damaged. So I think I'm going to let her get away. I'm going to plonk down Galas over here, and I'm just going to tank up some healing. All right, Galas, you block the path. There's no one else down there. It looks like. You can get to there, so you go here, and you come down here. Alright, I want you to sit and guard. Again, there's some useless protector drones over here. I don't want you to die, um, so I do want you to come back to the mainland. You can go down here and get the healing. You stay where you are, you stay where you are. You come all the way down here. And you guys advance too. I might need you in particular for your slowing to tear, even though you're weak. And you need to stay where you are. It's a shame that you've moved. It would be good to have you in range of a healer. put you up here for now. Alright. No! Okay, Galas. Gonna boldly run away. So Malkish are in here. You go around the side and get the slow. Oh, crap. Oh no! I don't want to lose my shide. Um, okay, well... Alright, and the Union does absolutely nothing, which is why I don't really like this mechanic all that much. Because it's just basically, it, there's no skill involved, it's just you get into the situation where... Um, and I, I, I'm going to lose my, my shide, um, so that's very frustrating. Can I put someone in here who she's more likely to attack, who she can't drain? Maybe you? You want to go there? Whatever. But she will, I mean, she can just use her blade attack, and um, it would be a miracle if she didn't kill Sathenia. Maybe, maybe miracles can happen. We'll see. Well, that there's pretty much a miracle. So I can't use Sustinia to get the slow now, um, and unfortunately she regenerates as well, so she's just going to get tankier and tankier as she sits there, uh, and my guys are just going to get weaker and weaker because she deals a ton of damage to them. Um, what I can do is get Detea, put Detea over here, and I just really, really hope that this works with the slow, because this is something of a sort of Hail Mary. Jeez. 
jamminess. Okay, I got jammy. Alright, Ledinor claims the kill. And then I go in with Malkashar. She slowed. The linear sits behind. Gonna get a spectre and plonk it round here. Okay, there is a drone. There is a, a drone here, but it's too slow. Uh, it doesn't look like anyone can actually reach me here. Um, so I'm just going to get this house by put you there, or maybe here. Go, let's get the house, and then you can be healed. But I need to use the union with you. more like it. But she doesn't run away. Okay, she's uh, still at it. Still game. You guys stay where you are. She actually, she doesn't... Now interestingly when she's hit, um, it seems like when she's hit by a melee attack, she doesn't actually, she seems to actively regain. Well let's get, let's get this demon out of the way first. Ledinor should be able to have a crack at that. Demons and Shaxlal like to hit on 60% on 40% chance. We know this. Okay, so you now can hop. And we need someone. We need someone to slow. You come back here. When you come around here, and, and Gallus unfortunately is the only person available for the task, but fortunately it looks like she's going to miss with most of her hits. Alright, she did end up on more hit points from that, so that's unfortunate, but she is slowed. Darkness unto the enemies of your ire! I doubt she will be able to keep this up for much longer. All right, awesome. Okay. <laughs> Whew. Every time I fight one of these bosses, my heart is in my mouth. Is that an expression? Oh, oh well, should be. If it isn't, it should be. Okay, everyone get going. We've got another Zephyr there. One Zephyr shouldn't be enough to take down my demon, but don't want to take the chance. You stay where you are and get two hit points. Well, you know, 50% defense on a, on a building. Okay, try it. And you stay and get health. All right, not too bad. And then, uh, ooh. The Battle of the Drainy Slowers down here. Unfortunately, there are quite a lot of them. Um, I don't like it when dread bats just come out of nowhere. 
Malkeshar is now 40 points off another level. So I could try for the kill. Alright, now if he can kill a level 3 unit, he'll be leveling up. And otherwise, I'm going to need to press forward with units who have more vision. Alright, there's a, another house down there. Can't see any enemies, but there could be some lurking in the void. So let's take a spectre out for a closer look. Ah yes, there's a, a dread bat. Unfortunately that dread bat can get Igor, but it's the only one of its kind if I eliminate the one that's down here. So that's my next task. In you go. Ledinor. Um, yeah, I'll use you. I choose you. Are you guys just going to... I think it's probably best if you just stay where you are for now. Need to heal up. You can come down. And you can go up here. Alright, it's on 10. Well, the spectres can't quite one-shot it, which is frustrating. And it can get away if I don't kill it. So I am going to send in Ledinor. And good Ledinor finishes it off. And the spectres progress. Deathy is quite close to another level up as well. Okay, well you didn't quite give as good as you got, um, and I am running out of turns now, but it looks like the edge of the map is, is almost in sight. I think I haven't had any problem with the spectres going over the void yet, so... Okay... Will you out somehow. I'd rather not do it with a spectre. It seems like the spectres are the units who are at the front. Kind of want to leave my units where they are just for one turn more so that they can get the maximum amount of, uh, of the good stuff. Can't lure you out with this spectre. Try and lure you out with one more. Alright, you can come in if you like. Got more yellow units. Ah, uh, she doesn't run out of money, does she? Must be digging into the treasury special reserve here. And of course, they're coming for my leader. That is one good thing. Um, regardless of how much fog on the map, the ed the enemy always knows where your leader is, and they will always send units in a direct line. Something special about the AI. You can actually use it to uh, to good effect, as I did in one of the previous missions. But Anywho. Uh-oh. There's another assault drone up there. Alright, end up a little better off out of that than I would have otherwise done. Um, I can lure out one of these guys with Deathy. No kill there. See if Igor wants to get the kill. There we go, and he's not too far from another level. Should be able to... this guy's gonna come out, this guy's gonna come out. 
Um, worth looking where the yellow troops are coming from. And over here, it's quite a challenge to fend them off. So I think the best bet is to put Erethan and Galas up front. And now uh, you on this side. Okay, you can more or less attack who you like now. Um, and you might be very well tempted to suicide on Malkeshar. And indeed, it wouldn't be all that bad an option at this point, except that he's on a village and so he's quite well defended. Um, what I don't want you to do is to both go for Igor, and you can't because of the position of the Spectre. So I think we're good as we are. Oh! Okay, so there's more flying nasties. You're quite tough. I want to just move Alinea back a bit. You do quite a lot of damage against these guys. And just use your nice fire damage. And then I think, hopefully, Ledinor... Yeah, Ledinor gets in the finisher. These guys are both skirmishers, so... Tricky, tricky, tricky. Well, Keshar, you stay where you are and get a bit more health, despite the despite the time. I, I can't really push forward until I've defeated all these guys anyway. Bad, bad things. Good work, Igor. Now these guys can't reach, unless I put someone here, they can't reach the, the sentry drone, which is good. I can't reach them at all. Put you on the house. Put you back here. Now you can choose how you play this. And I, mean, and I think you'll probably go for Malkeshar just because of your damage bonus, but that will not be a wise choice. Here, though, I need to be a bit careful of Deathy. So I'm going to swap them around. Let's finish this, Blady, please, without taking too much damage. Perfect. Alright, now we've got two Blady boys, and we've got a demon who can't quite reach. The demons do fire damage, so I want to keep them away from my spectres, especially Slashy, who's looking a bit beat up. But we can deal with that. First off, Galas. This one's pretty battered now. Ledinor, you're almost at a level, so if you can kill this one. So I'm going to try and get a slow. 
There. You go up around here. And you just get two hits. Lovely. So, now I think everyone else can take care of themselves, so please move on. Even Malkesha. Actually, I'm going to put in the mushrooms. Go there just fine. Can't move very far anyway. Uh, now it's a, the trick of dealing with all these ray blades that are coming up my butt. I'm just going to hold them off for a bit first. Seeing as ray blades don't actually really like to attack my spectres very much. You go and get healing. Can you get healing too? No, you can't quite. And there's no, hopefully no more drones up here. You could go and explore down here. There's nothing preventing that. Do we see anything interesting? Does look like it. Maybe there's more drones that will come out and bite me in the ass. Hello, oh, drones. Oh, you little bastards. Kesha, you're too slow. Alinea, you're too slow. Everyone's too slow to join in this fight. Nice, very nice. Okay, Deathy, you get you get yourself up to another level as well. That would be glorious. Meanwhile, I think you need to come down and keep blocking these guys while everyone else moves into position. This guy's still alive, that's frustrating. Alright, now this guy's no longer still alive. Galas solved the problem, go Galas. Go Erethan, go Ledinor. Go back, Igor, get health. And now we can continue to push with the remaining 17 turns. Now Alinea must be down here in the back. All right, now everyone's in position. Alinea's on full health, no less. blade over here and I ought to be able to comfortably take it out just to scout a bit okay there's nothing obviously back there I can send in fire lady all right it's on 11 health and 
Conveniently, that's the number of hit points that one of my spectres ought to take to kill it. Now, so we've got evil trees at the back. They, um, the demons can't range me. Okay, now the problem with this is there's not much space, but it is the way that the weak units came, so that does suggest... It does suggest that it's the right way to go. Okay, we've got a Hell Guardian blocking the path, we've got a Demoness Zephyr. Uh, these will not stand in my way, not for long. But my slower units are going to take a while to catch up. Who needs the health? You guys all need health. You could do with sitting on there. You stay there. Alright, good. You just run in and go for it. Not brilliant. Move, 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 move. Move, move, move with the Union dudes. Um, should I try and lure out the Hell Guardian as well? I think I should because the turns are running short. So put someone there. How resistant are you to blade damage? Resistant enough, good. Because Galas is faster, I'm going to allow him to overtake. We're in a good place now. What defense are you there? You're, you're 30 if you go there. Good. Okay, I want you on 30. Okay, demons and bars. Nasty amount of damage there. Run away! Run away! Elinia. I hope. Let's just see what's down here. You just don't know when to give up. Neither do you. By now, you have surely seen that the power of the Union can destroy you easily. Accept your fate and fight us instead of fleeing like a lowly rat. Alright, and we've got Mrs. Boss Lady herself. She can't range me from here. So I'm gonna get Alinea in to do as much range damage as I can. Which turns out to be almost none, interestingly. What resistance do these guys have? No resistance to cold. Alright, well you know who's got cold damage. Yeah, you know who's got cold damage. But first you jump back. Two hits. And there we go, there's the level for Malkeshar, 121. Fantastic. Maybe should have saved that experience, but... All right, time to go in with the spectres. And Slashy gets the kill. That's good because it means I don't have to send another spectre forward. I'm going to send the forest spirit forward instead. 
and everyone else can just proceed. You step back so that Sothinia can provide healing to Melinia. You keep going. Slow. Now, six movement units that only have foot movement are the, are the true slow pokes these days. Um, I can't get healing. Oh, yes, I can. You know what I can do. You can go back to the house. And the drones can't reach you. Fantastic. All right. The demons move in. We've got a sneaky demoness Zephyr coming around the side here. And... I kind of feel like this final boss fight in this level... I'm going to just take it and save um, and reload from this point when things get ugly. And it's all going to be part of the same part. So... Yeah, you'll get a bit more insight into the process behind the creativity. Cool. All right, that wasn't very successful. What about you? Okay, you'll only kill her if you get two hits, which is kind of annoying. Two hits? What am I talking about? If you get all hits. All your hits. How far can she range? She can range anyone who stands there. And Yeah, alright. So... Not the Union. I want to save that. Good. And Alinea also is getting a bit closer to a level now. Which is nice. Mal. Oh, you can use the Union, why not? Get a one hit KO. And now there's a Chaos Arbor Lestier over here. There is an Assault Drone here who will come and attack, probably come and attack my Spectre, I guess. Um, you take the front lines. When the Assault Drone comes out, then's the time to strike. Get Gallus up here so he can ultimately run interference. You stay where you are and gain 2 HP. You stay where you are. You stay where you are. You move in. I think I will need someone to come around. But um, anyway. Oh, nice. Oh, ooh. Where the hell do you come from? I guess you must have spawned when I didn't notice. Yes, yes, your druid is in fact blind. These demons, one of them at least, can reach. Um, so short on turns. Okay, let her know you're more useful at the back anyway, so you stay here. Good job. And I, I think the answer is just to move Elinia forward one and allow her to get the kill. But then she takes so much damage from these guys. Ah, ugh. What I really don't want to do is get Elissa in on the fight before I absolutely have to. Especially this particular fight, I kind of feel like she's not going to go down until she goes down, down, given that it's the bottom end of the map. So I'm going to use Galas and slow. 
And Galas knocks it out of the court. The Spectre can also run back and get some healing. Interestingly, that uh, Zephyr has disappeared. Is it going to? Yeah, it's going to. It's going to steal my houses. Well, I don't care all that much. You sit where you are. Um, if you want to come down here, that's fine by me. And then you can get some healing. And everyone else is good where they are. Ow! Keep whacking Galas, why don't you? Why don't you? Why doesn't someone come and kill this demon? How about you? You ought to be able to do it. Down you go. Well, this Arbalestier can get in. Galas, you go here. And there's another drone back there. Hmm, okay. This is going to be a very, very difficult fight. Well, that went well at least. And now, if Alinea comes out, she's only going to be able to attack Gallus. And that's fine. Sorry, Alyssa, not Alinea. Every time, every time. Um, that Zephyr is busy capturing villages. It's kind of annoying, because it does mean that... Um, Elinia is going to continue to produce weak troops, but uh, nothing that can really be done about it. You stay where you are, you come forward, you stay where you are, you all come forward. The next turn we can hopefully push on the main front line. Miss, 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 miss. Yes, you miss. Galas is like, lol. <laughs> okay. Um, now, because of leadership, this thing is an absolute beast. So I was, I'm very tempted to try and let Galas get the kill. But the trouble is, if Galas fails to get the kill, then Galas also just dies. So um, instead, Sathinia is going to do the job. I thought she wasn't going to manage it there. Hoo, hoo, hoo. All right, so now what we need is the power of the union and some slowing. This guy hasn't come out yet, interestingly. Uh, but, but will do as soon as... You, how, how good are you against Pierce? You've got 50% against Pierce, right? Yeah, you have. Good. Okay. You can do the interference thing. Um, not all that effectively, but you can do it. Galas, you just run away. And then we need a slow. And if the slow comes from this side... Yeah, that's the best plan. <coughs> Okay, lots of damage, but that's to be expected. And then what we need is you two to come further down. Like you go there, you go here, and now we've got a nice union ability. Um, now, Alinea could, in principle, now be attacked by all three of these dudes. Want to be able to like to be able to do something to prevent that from happening. Um, she can't move. The spectre can't get that far out. Yeah, all right. Slashy the spectre. What happens if you stand here? 
It makes a little bit of difference, doesn't make a huge amount of difference. It means that the, uh, the Arbalestier at least can't attack Elenia. That's something. The only person everyone can attack now is uh, Lethrone the Forest Spirit. And I can move Deathy down. These two can attack Deathy if they want. And he won't quite level. And I don't think they should be able to kill him really. But just in case, I'm going to put him back here. Alright, you're on full health now. You move in, you move in, you move in, and now it's time for the Union and Malkeshar, because he's at the back, is going to do it. One, one miss this time. still at it aren't you yeah this <laughs> this zephyr is really like haha -ha. you know here's the way to win the scenario it's to uh, to steal all of uh, all of cyber druid's villages this would be a false presumption but um my my mission now is to wipe out everyone who's up here i think Unfortunately, the Arbalestier is tough, and most of my units can't range it. You could do 25 damage, something. Gonna go down and kill this tree. Can't see if there's anything back here. Doesn't look like there is. I've got nine turns left. Nine turns. Won't matter if I lose, though. What I could do is plonk a linear here, Malkeshar here, use Malkeshar and the Arbalestier, and then use the Union. Yep, that's tempting. I'll do that. Just got to be careful not to use the Union already. And you're going to do a ton of damage to Malkeshar by this. Or not. Good job. Okay. Now you... Come around here, sit on the base. You try and get the kill. Yeah! Alright, and now you... Oh, all my spectres are on over 40 HP now. That's just fantastic. Um, you can go onto a slightly better defensive position and slow. Okay. I'll put Sothinia here. I want to put someone else here so that... And the mo her movement is constrained. Ideally, someone who can't be drained. And you can't be killed in one hit. I think even with the fire attack, you can't be killed in one hit. So, well, you definitely can't, but you can be drained. So I'm going to put you here in front of Sothinia. You go behind Sothinia. You go back here. And the linear hitter with the union. Union not super strong in this circumstance, apparently. Detea could die now.
going for Alinea, interestingly, and now if Alinea manages to not die while using the Union, then Alinea will actually level up, and that would be fantastic. How likely is that? Well, I mean, I could kill her, and she can't kill me, so it's worth a shot. Don't even need to slow yet. I think I can kill her. Yeah, I can definitely kill her. One hit, two hits, come on! Ah. No, but I do get shielding two, which gives me arcane resistance plus 10% and impact resistance 10%. Now let's see now if... Yeah, Elinia's, Elinia's resist, resistances, whatever they actually are in real life, they are not displaying correctly here. So I think I might have screwed them up by going for shielding three before getting shielding one and two. Uh, it is what it is. Okay, now she's stuck there, so whatever she does doesn't make much difference now. Don't even really need to slow her. Um, perhaps I should so that she doesn't kill anyone. Hmm, how to finish this off in a sensible manier. How are you doing for experience, Galas? Well, you could well die if you go and attack it, because you can't level just from just from the attack, unlike most of the rest of them. So I'm gonna put you on this house. Move you away one. Okay, now if you get hit with all five of Alyssa's attacks, you will die. But I don't think Alyssa's going to do that, because the AI thinks that she's weak. So I'm going to take the chance to put Lathrade here, move everyone else away. Actually, you don't even need health. Well, you're not quite trapped if I move you away from here. No. Hmm. Dang. Okay. Alright, in that case, Sathinia, you go and get, get the slow. No! Oh, crap. Okay. Um, three slow misses. Um, you can't get in then. Oh, you can. You, you can if, if... Oh, no. Lethrade can't move, so you can't. Nuts. Okay. Not good. I'm just hoping that Elise is going to be a dumbass and attack someone and, and not attack anyone. That's the only thing I can hope for here. She's trapped in. What? Why did she just... Why did she just... What? She just literally went up to full health for literally no reason. That is... that is sickening. Thank you. Thank you, Alinea. Um, did you just get an after maximum level advancement? Is that what happened? I think it is. But how can it be? You're on 32 experience out of 200. This makes no sense. Alright, gonna have to try this slow again. Um, with apologies to you, Sathinia, because you might die. Or maybe... maybe now I should be trying it with Alinea. Yeah. Bring Sathinia back. Bring Malkesha around. Alyssa... Um, the... yeah, Alyssa's trapped. Get the slow. Weirdly, she's taken that damage. She hasn't regenerated it. Union time. Okay, and she clobbers Malkeshar with that attack. You stay where you are, you stay where you are, everyone stay where you are. We're doing good. Except for turns. I need to kill her within the turns.
Now I have no idea what's going on with her health now. Um, it's down to almost half. Okay, you hop over this way. And Sothenia, you come in again for the slow. Try not to die. Millennia Union. Always so many misses with the Union. Now please, please don't kill Sothenia. I need Sothenia to live. She can't do anything, good. Okay, I think Alyssa's now pretty much fully bugged out. So, what can I do about this? Well, I want to get... I want to get Alinea out of the way. So that she doesn't die. Put you there. Sothenia can come around here. And I need to put someone here. And I think the best bet is that if I use you to slow from a 50% terrain. Oh, you're dead. Now, it's tempting to reload. Very tempting. But since this is the final boss fight, I'm going to... It, it might be possible I didn't even need to do that. But actually, this damage, this this arcane damage is just brutal, man. Um, all right. Now that seeing as she's not regaining health like she was before, I'm going to let Gallus try and take care of this. Surely, surely we must be nearly there. Surely. Okay, well, if Gallus manages to not die now, which he, he shouldn't, um, then he will get a level. Yeah, there's that level. Oh, and here comes our old friend. All right, but the Union should be able to, enough to seal it now. So let's bring it in. The combined power of Alinea and Malkeshar hit the demoness one last time, shattering into her magic defense shield and sending her flying across the bridge. Unable to regain her footing, she desperately grabbed her sword and prepared for the killing blow. Go on, Alinea. Do what you must do. Now that I have failed, there's no purpose left for me. Who are you? Why would I tell you? I would feel much better about ending your miserable life if you did. I am Alyssa. I dedicated my life to studying the ancient empire's history from whatever remnants I could find amidst the sands. That is, before I found him and Uriah. Their great power and knowledge truly changed me, and in time they will change this world too. Where is your master hiding? She is not going to answer. Off with her head! You're not going to do it, are you? I can give you an answer, but only if you swear you will spare my life. Don't listen to her lies, Alinea. You know these creatures cannot be trusted. Alinea stared directly into the demoness' eyes, with a frightening expression of suppressed rage. Time seemed to stop for the Watchers but not a single one dared to break the uneasy silence. Then she spoke. Tell me what you know, and you can keep whatever little life you have left, as long as you get out of my sight as quickly as you can. Now out with it. But she... Do you see the passage ahead? Go through it and you will be an inferno. 
The entrance to his icy fortress is just across the snow following the tip of the road. There you will find the heart of the hive and his lair. But be warned, once you enter, there will be no going back, and you should be prepared to face your greatest fears. Very well, then. Now go. Why would you do this, Elinia? That woman is Anlinde's murderer. I cannot bring myself to kill someone so much weaker than I. It would be unfair and cruel. You remember how the Lich Malkeshar came to be, do you not? Let yourself succumb to wrath, and you become as bad as the foul-minded creatures you fight. Now, it's time to go find the answers we seek. Let us see if the Chaos Emperor can be stopped before the badness of this place consumes us as well. All right, scenario complete. Now, I'm a little bit irritated that right at the end I lost one of my most useful units. Um, let's just see. Statistics. Was one loss, only one loss. Um, and it was this elvish prowler, Detea, who's been with me almost since the start. So the only living elf, elf who's not obligatory at this point is Sothinia the Shide, who's really kind of more of a fairy in a way. She doesn't literally have the Sylvan Spark ability like Lethrida does, but uh, it's close enough. Okay, well I made it, and I made it in one go. So since it doesn't, uh, since I don't have to mess up the editing of the video now, I'm going to take it, and uh, I will see you for the next scenario, scenario 23, which I believe is the final scenario of Invasion from the Unknown.